The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Here comes the Queen. Ladies and gentlemen, you are looking at one of the reasons that the women's revolution has become the women's evolution. First ever women's Hell in a Cell match against Sasha Banks. An amazing Iron Man match as well. Charlotte has accomplished it all in such a short period of time. One day, she'll be joining her father in the Hall of Fame. It's Bailey! Ha <laughs> ha, yeah! Hug life! Sit down, Byron. Don't touch me. Relationships are all about ratios. Maybe you'll get a date with one of them finally. Huh? Ladies and gentlemen, here comes Bailey. Back in your seat, Saxton. Bailey's not going to hug you. It's just an infectious feeling when Bailey comes to town, when Bailey competes. Everybody's feeling hug life, except Corey. I think she just winked at you, Byron. I think so, too. Hey, Bailey. Introducing the challenger from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Introducing the champion. From San Jose, California, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Bailey. Don't change that dial. Once Bailey was signed to Monday Night Raw, she renewed a rivalry with former friend and foe Charlotte Flair. During their days in NXT, they were part of the famous Four Horsewomen, a group who helped revolutionize women's wrestling. Once the hugger came to Raw in 2016, the battle was on. Bailey and Charlotte Flair know each other so well thanks to their days together in NXT. Charlotte was determined to show Bailey that things were going to change now that the hugger was in the big time on Monday Night Raw. I'll give Bailey this. Whether it was on Monday Night Raw or 2017 special events like the Royal Rumble and Fastlane, Bailey showed Charlotte that she was up for the challenge. But if I know the Queen, Bailey better watch her back. DDT! Fight him! Unbelievable athleticism! What a stop! Good grief! What a hurricanrana! Oof! Neck breaker! Elbow right to the back of the neck! Oof. Boom! Nice! Time slam. 
Vicious. Boom! Ho, ho, ho. Uh-oh, look at this. They can't walk after that attack to the back. The main roster was introduced to Charlotte Flair as one of the members of Team PCB with Paige and Becky Lynch. On that very night, the women's revolution kicked off as two other NXT stars joined the main roster and turned the WWE women's division upside down. Mention of oh. Absolutely planet. Oh. ball right to the nose. I have to go back to Team PCB for a second. They had two rival factions with plenty of talent, Team Bad and Team Bella. But PCB won most of those battles. All three teams dissolved before long, and Paige founded a new faction since then. But Paige, Charlotte, and Becky may be the most talented women's trio ever. Look at her go. Oh, continuing to punish them. Oh, that might have just broken something. Firing calf crushers in. Cinched in, nowhere to go. The challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. I was lucky enough to call many of Charlotte Flair's biggest matches as she kickstarted the women's revolution with the likes of Bailey, Sasha Banks, Becky Lynch, and so many more. German suplex spike. Drop kick. It hits the mark. Dodges that one. Bailey in full control here with a Bailey plex. Charlotte is in trouble. Corey, Charlotte's NXT run helped more than just women. It also helped the brand grow as those women's matches brought many new viewers to WWE Network. NXT is appointment viewing for folks every week. And the women there are tomorrow's main eventers. Charlotte's groundwork is a big reason for that. Up goes Bailey. Double underhook suplex. Ooh, what impact. Stunner! Emphatically delivered. I've made it quite clear. Charlotte, big move coming. Some people might not agree, but I think sometimes Bailey can be a bit too much. Looking for a repeat. Oh, what a tackle. Uh-oh. Here we go. Here we go. It's perfect that Bailey's big move, the Bailey to Bailey, shows just how precise and powerful Bailey can be. When the hugger plant beautiful technique. Charlotte is in trouble. Let's look at the replay. Nice move right there. This isn't looking good for her, guys. No, it's not, Michael. She looks absolutely out of it. She's looking wobbly, guys. And I assure you, the hazards outside the ring are very, very real. This is a bad situation. She is on fire. Well, this will damage your back. The champ to the top turnbuckle. Bailey has her in her sights. One more shot, and she's done. Oh, elbow drop. Piercing. She can't take any more of this. Drop kick. Ooh, nasty impact. The huddle will one. Oh, nice suplex. Man, looked like the champ was down and out for a moment there, but the champion into the cover. Oh, somehow. Yeah, if you want to know why Charlotte is a multiple champ, there's your answer. Hard. Uh-oh. Look at Bob Backbreaker. Oh, perfect kick. Forearm to the oh, face. Oh, nothing fancy about that. Incoming. Wow. Elbow. Uh -oh. the face destroyed and that's how a superstar takes advantage of their ring position such a high ring iq charlotte flair in full control here that's why they call her genetically superior you gotta believe this one's over this does not look good for bailey 
No breathing room here for Bailey. Charlotte is all business right now. The Queen taking over. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. It's become Bailey's MO to fight from underneath. Since her days as NXT, she's had to overcome setback after setback. Well, certainly known as an ultimate underdog, Bailey faltered many times early in her career. But her devotion and diehard attitude inspired a passionate following within the WWE Universe that in turn lifted Bailey to great heights. Oh, oh my God, what a oh. German suplex! Unreal! We harped on Bailey's underdog past. It still sticks with her, but she does find ways to put herself in a position for success despite her humble nature. Well, underdogs are good for fairy tales, Cole, but this, this is real life, where the women's division is about asserting dominance. Underdogs don't dominate. They just get lucky once in a while. I don't see Bailey carrying around a four-leaf clover. Hurricane Rana! Byron, it's moments like Bailey winning her first WWE Women's Championship to put our jobs in perspective. To see dreams come true right in front of us gives me goosebumps. Yeah, watching Bailey, the little girl who dragged her father to every live event and made him wait after the show so she could get autographs from every superstar, now become champion, it was an incredible culmination. Oh, an elbow drop. This might be it. Oh, my. Saxton gushed over Bailey's first WWE Women's Championship win like he stole Bailey's diary or something. If that just wasn't the cutest, most heartwarming story you ever told, Saxton. No, Corey, I'm not going to allow you to be a negative Nancy on this. Bailey told her dad she was going to stand in the ring as a champion one day, and she did just that. Boom. German suplex! Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! What a stomp! Good grief! And it's Bailey feeling fired up. Oh, and a snap there. That'll give you whiplash. Boom, oh, what impact. Drop kick hits the mark. Talk about dominating the action. Charlotte is rolling here. This is it. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Bailey has her in her sights. She can't take much more of this. Bailey, Bailey to belly. Now that's how you successfully defend your title. Barely at two and a half. She's still in this one. Bailey has spent her whole career with many of her peers doubting her abilities. The competition tends to overlook Bailey and disregard her accomplishments. Oh, here it comes! Bailey, Bailey to belly! Game, set, match. This one is over. Bold move going forward again. This is going to be big. One way or another. Look at this. Boom! That's it. She goes for the cover. Michael, to pick up on what you said about Bailey not getting respect, it dates all the way. Bailey has done it! An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. To get the pinfall victory over such a high-quality opponent is incredibly impressive, Michael. I think Boston is stunned by the outcome here, guys.